Hi, I'm Jenny with Show Me Cute. Today I have yet another simple wall decoration idea to show you. Over here on this wall, you can see the fun idea that I have just completed. This was inspired by a rug that I saw on Pottery Barn Team and I thought would be fairly simple to put on the wall to add lots of color and fun to a teenager's room. For this project, you're going to need this little sponge tool and craft paint in the, your desired colors. I prefer the Folk Art brand. I get these at any local craft store, as well as the sponge tool that comes in a package of multicolor, or sorry, multi sizes, or just uh, all the same size. Um, I have my paint already on my plate. And I have one more section of the wall that needs to be done, so I'm going to show you how I did it. For this part of the wall, I'm going to take my tool and dip it in my paint. You want to get a good fair amount of paint, but don't get too gloppy on the edges. If you get too much, you can just move it around. Probably a better idea for you would be to start out as light as possible because you can always go over it if you need more paint. Um, these tools are so simple to use. And for this particular design, um, I'm going to start with a couple of circles over here. And I just take my tool and push and spin. And I get a perfect circle. For this design though, I have figured out by watching or looking at the rug that I found that the middle dot needs to be just a little bit bigger. So if you spin just a little bit outside, you can get just a little bit bigger dot than what it makes all by itself. So then I'm going to load up my brush again. I'm going to start to the outside and push and spin push and spin, push and spin, push and spin. And I do that all the way around until I have my circle. To make these designs, if you um, look at Pottery Barn Teen and you look at this rug, it's in the girl section, they have something laid out for you. And what I did was just um, substituted a couple of different colors for what they had on the rug and based it on the design that was already on the rug to take out a little bit of the guesswork for me. So I'm going to keep going around and I'm going to add a couple of more rows to this color. And you can see I can get several dots out of one load of the brush. And that's with the better paint that I prefer. Some of the paints that you can get at the craft store are not as good of quality as the other. Um, I think I mentioned in the beginning of the video that I like the Folk Art brand. It's a little bit thicker paint and goes on the wall with a uh, better consistency. I'm going to add one more row around this set of dots and then I'll wash out my brush and move on to the next color. Give me a few minutes and I'll show you the final product. Okay, as you can see I've finished my polka dots. It only took me a couple of minutes. I just washed my brush in between each color and total time was about five minutes. So I think it's pretty cute. I'll give you another view of the whole room. Don't forget to subscribe and check back later for more videos on showmecute.com.